Oh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome back to the channel. Now, <laughs> this, this was the video that I've been waiting on. This is the angle that I needed to see to confirm what I already knew. All right. Hey, welcome, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is going to be my last video on this because this is the angle I needed to see. This is all the proof I needed. Now, you know, it's been this, all this, this talk about Will and Jada. Um, and let me just say this. Stop putting celebrities on pedestals. All right. Stop looking at them as role models for your children. All right. If you're a parent, you're the role model. Stop putting these celebrities on pedestals because a lot of times they do things. People, people uh, act like they're not human. Stop putting these celebrities on pedestals. I've seen a lot of people saying, I was, I was so disappointed in Will and this and this and that and that. I get it. But a lot of people be trying to, um, you know, they have these high standards for these celebrities. Like, he's not supposed to be, like, hey, <laughs> I ain't condoning what he did. He shouldn't have did it. You know what I mean? Like, it's something I wouldn't have done. But at the same time, as a man, I can't sit up here and tell another man not to do that. You know what I mean? Like, he he did it. He has to suffer the consequences. Whatever the case, whatever that's going to be. So far, it hasn't been nothing. <laughs> I will say, though, what shocked me the most was that and, and I heard that, I guess, they approached him and told him to leave, and he refused to leave. Now, to me, that's crazy, because I'm like, if you got security, you know, somebody refusing to leave, and, and, and in, my, in my mind, I was like, oh, they just, you know, they're going to let him stay for the ratings. That's what they're doing. Because all that came to my mind was thinking about uh, Charles Oakley when he got escorted out the New York Knicks game. You see all those security pulling him out. But what I'm about to show y'all, and I don't know if you guys seen this video yet. But uh, my friend, my wife's friend, well, my friend too, uh, she sent this to my wife. Um, now... This is the angle I wanted to see. Uh, this is after Will smacked him. This is after. What I want y'all to do is look at Jada's face. Well, look at Jada's reaction. It's, the, it's behind her. Hold on, let me get it here. Here is an angle most people have not seen. Look at so, Jada's reaction. <laughs> Look at how she's looking. It was a GI Jane. Keep my wife's name out. I'm going to, okay? So I can go. That was the greatest night in history of television. Okay. So we are here to uh, give a documentary. All right. So you guys can uh, go ahead and rewind it and pause it and all that. Um, so after he hit Chris Rock, like the angle everybody seen was... Um, Will Smith, you never seen Jada. To me, Jada didn't even realize Will, like, it seemed like she thought it was a skit. That's what I, I feel. 
And I'm saying that because the whole world, well, I can't speak for everybody, but most people don't look at Will Smith as a tough guy. Yes, he played tough guy roles in movies, but for the most part, you look at Will as a funny guy, right? Uh, and like I said before, even Eminem mentioned in one of his rap songs how Will Smith don't have to cuss in his videos or whatever. So nobody look at Will as a tough guy. One of the craziest memes I seen was it had Jada's face and it said, Will, I'm not impressed. Tupac would have shot him saying that even though he did what he did, there, there still wasn't enough for her. But if you watch her expression from the side, she didn't even realize that it was real, right? Will Smith didn't just smack Chris Rock. That smack was for everybody that thinks he's soft, which is, I'll, I'll say this, 60%, 60 to 70 percent Jada's fault, 40 to 30 wills. What I mean by that is all the stuff that Jada has put Will through, but on the same, you know, he stuck with her. He's still married to her. I know they took like a little break and that's what like August uh, Austin, whatever his name is, came into the picture and did that whole entanglement thing. Most men would have left to have that broadcast to the world. And that's the problem with their relationship is everybody's looking like, yo, hey, y'all saying all this stuff, but y'all the same ones who are putting it out there for people to see. So my whole thing is Will was doing that to, to show Jada, I'm not as soft as you think. You know, Jada is still infatuated with Tupac. Even though he's gone or people say he ain't gone, whatever the case may be, she's still, I feel, in love with him. Like, Will Smith will never match up to what Tupac was in her eyes. And he knows that. And he knows the world knows it. So my whole thing is like, what Will did, he shouldn't have did. But he was doing that to try to show the world, like, look, I'm not as soft. As, as the media and everybody is thinking, even my wife thinks I am, all right? I'm doing, when he, when he was yelling, keep my wife name out your mouth, he was saying that to everybody, not just Chris Rock. Because you guys know in 2016 at the Oscars, you know, J Jada was trying to boycott the Oscars because Will Smith wasn't nominated, all this and that. And Chris Rock made a joke about being, her being, her boycotting the Oscars is like me boycotting Rihanna's panties because I wasn't invited. Basically saying, who invited you? You know? And it's hard to believe for me that Chris Rock didn't know about Jada's health condition because they are friends. And she's been so open about it. You know what I mean? Uh, that's why he. I think he felt like the joke wasn't, I don't think the joke was funny. Like, not saying he shouldn't have did that, but I'm just saying, I don't think it was like, ha, 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 like, you know, I've heard better jokes. But in her eyes, she when she rolled her eyes, it was like, oh, like, here we go again. Because she was having those 2016 vibes. So her and Will, if you look at that angle, her and Will didn't even make eye contact after he said that joke. Will just was like, he laughed. You know, that's where everybody was confused. Like, Will laughed at the joke. And, you know, when he, when he slapped Chris Rock, and Chris Rock was like, Will Smith just smacked the out of me. You seen her laugh. I think she thought it was a joke. Until Will sat down and started yelling, keep my wife's name out your mouth. You saw her like turn her head to the side. And to me, as crazy as it might sound, she was like, oh my God, this is the Will that I wanted. You know what I mean? She, some people love that. They love that, that like, uh, like 
she like like I said with that meme, even though those aren't her words, but it's like she she liked that that part of Will, that aggressiveness, like she want like it's like that's what she been waiting to get out of him. You know what I mean? But like Will in his speech, how he said uh he's being called upon by God to protect people like it's an image he he's trying to put out there, but I don't think what we've been seeing from him is completely the real him. It's part of him, you know what I mean? But like I said, that was the angle that I needed to see. But Will Smith, that smack was for everybody. <laughs> you know, he was trying to show Jada, like, hey, I'm not as soft as you think I am, which you know, it's crazy because, like, if you got to prove that to your wife, I mean, damn, the disrespect. I think it's, it's disrespectful for her to want that out of him. You know what I mean? It shouldn't have happened. I think Will was wrong. I don't think the joke was funny. Um... And then there was a video going around saying Jada was talking about, I, she said something about, I don't give a damn what people think of my hair. So it's, it's crazy. But this is, this is, I just, this was a video I wanted to see. I wanted to show y'all. Uh, this is the last time I'm going to talk about it. But um, yeah, I thought Jada gave him type of, some type of signal to go up there. But she was even shocked that he did it. She was even shocked. But I know when they went home, she was probably all over him. Like, you know, all like she loved it. I mean, he was partying, dancing with his Oscar and everything. The fact that, you know, and, and I know Jim Carrey talked about it, talk about their Hollywood is spineless and stuff. Like the fact that he got a standing ovation after doing that. And again, shout out to Chris Rock for, because I know, I know I can think of, so many people that that would have swung back, you know, but um, yeah, that's the video I wanted to show y'all. Hey, comment below what y'all think, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Peace out.